All right, wanted to do a video about this Christmas parade in Wisconsin, this attack at the Christmas parade in Wisconsin by these two black supremacist terrorists and how this was a Illuminati sacrifice on the Satanic High Day of Saturnalia, a celebration of the Satanic High Day of Saturnalia. Obviously, it wasn't the actual day of Saturnalia, but this was a celebration of that Satanic Illuminati High Day. And this was a sacrifice. I do believe this was an Illuminati sacrifice. You can call me a nut, a conspiracy theorist all you want, but I do believe this was a Satanic Illuminati sacrifice on a celebration of the Satanic Illuminati High Day. Sacrifices in scripture by Israel when they were paganized always occurred in a similar manner as Christmas. They occurred in a similar manner as Christmas. It was always under a green tree. Okay, that's what Saturnalia is. Christmas is not a Christian holiday. It is a pagan holiday of Saturnalia, of the winter solstice. And sacrifices always occurred in a similar fashion as Christmas. That's why I believe this was an Illuminati sacrifice on the celebration of the Satanic High Day. Deuteronomy chapter 12, verses 2 to 3. You shall utterly destroy all the places wherein the nations... Oh, my cat just jumped on the screen. Sorry about that. Let me move him out of the way. Alright, sorry about that. Just had a bit of an interruption there from my cat. Typical of him. But anyway, Deuteronomy chapter 12, verses 2 to 3. Ye shall utterly destroy all the places wherein the nations which ye shall possess serve their gods upon the high mountains and upon the hills and under every green tree. And ye shall overthrow their altars and break their pillars and burn their groves with fire. And ye shall hew down the graven images of their gods and destroy the names of them out of that place. 1 Kings chapter 14, verses 22 to 23. And Judah did evil in the sight of the Lord, and they provoked him to jealousy with the sins which they had committed above all that their fathers had done. For they also built them high places and images and groves on every high hill and under every green tree. First King, Second Kings chapter 16 verses 3 to 4. But he walked in the way of the kings of Israel, yea, and made his son to pass the fire according to the abominations of the heathen whom the Lord had, whom the Lord cast out from before the children of Israel. And he sacrificed and burned incense in the high places and on the hills and under every green tree. Second Kings chapter 17 verses 9 to 11. And the children of Israel did secretly those things that were not right against the Lord their God. And they built them high places in all their cities, from the tower of the watchman to the fenced city. And they set them up images and groves on every high hill and under every green tree. And there they burnt incense in all the high places, as did the heathen whom the Lord carried away before them, and wrought wicked things to provoke the Lord to anger. Uh, Second Chronicles chapter 28 verses 3 to 4. Moreover, he burnt incense in the valley of the son of Hinnom, and burnt his children in the fire, after the abominations of the heathen, whom the Lord had cast out before the children of Israel. He sacrificed also and burnt incense in the high places, and on the hills, and under every green tree. And Isaiah chapter 57 verses 4 to 5. Against whom do ye sport yourselves? Against whom make ye a wide mouth and draw out the tongue? Are ye not the children of transgression, the seed of falsehood, inflaming yourselves with idols under every green tree, slaying the children in the valleys under the cliffs of the rocks? So those are just a few scriptures. There's many more I could cover. But sacrifices occurred in a similar manner to Christmas. They put idols under every green tree and sacrificing caused the children that passed through the fire. That's what I believe what this was at this Christmas parade. It was a very tragic event. There were multiple fatalities. There were some injuries. About 20 people were injured. Uh, these black supremacist lunatics who did the attack deserve to be punished. And I would say give them the death penalty because they've killed people. And murderers should get the death penalty. As per uh, exit, or as per Genesis chapter 9 verses 5 to 6. And many of those scriptures too. Uh, Exodus chapter uh, 20 verse 15 I believe it is. I can't remember the exact verse. But... This was a tragic event. It was very, very sad what happened. It was very tragic. 
but I believe this was an Illuminati sacrifice on this celebration of the satanic Illuminati high day of Saturnalia. And we see here with the scriptures that sacrifices occurred under every green tree, kind of like Christmas, putting presents under every green tree. You see, Christmas is not a Christian holiday. It's the Roman Catholic pagan perversion of the birth of Christ. Christ Mass is where Christmas comes from. It's a Roman Catholic holiday. And this attack at this Christmas parade, I fully believe, was you know, possibly an Illuminati blood sacrifice on the satanic Illuminati high day. So I just wanted to show that and give the scriptures about that. Uh, just showing that Christmas is not a Christian holiday and the Illuminati are very, very satanic and they don't care who gets in their way. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye. Thank you.